Well, the latest controversy in, in the judiciary is stirred by a petition by 14 justices of the Supreme Court accusing the Chief Justice of Nigeria of gross negligence and mismanagement of funds continues to ruffle feathers in different quarters. In a leaked memo, the 14 justices of the Apex Court had accused the CJN of abandoning its responsibilities and diverting funds meant for the smooth operation of the Supreme Court. Despite the CJN's response through its media aid denying the allegations, the National Assembly has shown interest in the matter. National Assembly correspondent Tijesu Adelio reports. The National Assembly has always been concerned about issues in the judiciary. The brewing trouble between the CJN and his colleagues is a situation they feel could have dire consequences for that arm of government, which is saddled with the responsibility of interpreting the law and dispensing justice. At previous legislative committee meetings, public hearings and budget defense sessions, the judicial body had always complained about the paucity of funds, poor welfare of judges and the state of affairs in the courts. A suit was also instituted in court against the National Assembly, Attorney General of the Federation, the National Judicial Council, seeking pay review for judges. All attempts by the National Assembly for an out-of-court settlement in the case filed by Sebastian Horn, a senior advocate of Nigeria, has collapsed. But in the fiscal appropriation for 2022, the National Assembly significantly jacked up allocation to the judiciary following its proposal of an all-time high spending estimate of 120 billion naira. This figure is a 9% increase from the 110 billion that was the judiciary's yearly allocation for three consecutive years from 2019 to 2021. Now the National Assembly may also be asking probing questions and would need answers as the judiciary seems to have been put on trial. I believe that we owe it to Nigerians to look into what is happening in that arm of government with a view to bring in solutions to the problems that judiciary uh, in Nigeria faces. So I will urge our committee on judiciary, human rights and legal matters to get involved with the CGN and the judiciary generally at this level, the Supreme Court, and find out what the real issues are and how the National Assembly can help. The arm of government. Tijesu Adeoye, TVC News, Abuja.